Howdy. Welcome to Steampunk Diesel. So I know it's been a while since y'all seen this truck, and I don't know if I did an update last time, but let me show y'all what we got going on. From last time, y'all might have seen it. She had a steely wheels, which I don't know if I showed that, but stock rims. But now she's got 14 wides in the front, and obviously the eight and a halfs in the rear on 20s. And so what we got going on today is uh, we're cleaning this thing up, taking this off, getting rid of this, and we're finally putting a bed on it. As y'all can tell, it's up in the air. She's fine, no pasa nada. But yeah, we're gonna cut this off because Ford decided to weld this to the frame instead of like normal trucks where they're bolted on. Uh, yeah, we're gonna take that off, clean this up, clean up the wiring. Obviously we got the airbag hoses out the way and we're gonna need to figure out how to mount this to that, but we got some ideas. But anyways, don't mind it, she's a bit dirty. Yep, haven't cleaned her in a while, as I can tell. But stay tuned, because we're going to get that bed on, show y'all here what we got going on, and what we'll do to it, and uh, stick with it. We'll show y'all some burnouts later. But, yeah, we're going to get started on this, and hopefully it goes as planned. So, see y'all guys in a little bit. All right, we're back. And as y'all can tell, here's the update. Here's where we're at. So we got the wiring out of the way. Got the tow hitch set up removed. The hitch set up. Got the spare tire mount gone, as y'all can tell. Here's where we took it off. So. Yeah, here's our update. Now we just need to clean up the wiring. Sounds like they're shooting doves over there or something. But then we got to figure out a way... Because uh, if y'all can see it, maybe I should get under it. But So the bed kind of curves back. You can kind of see it right here. So we're going to need to find a way to either integrate those so it won't hit back here on the taillights. Or we're going to have to cut those off and then notch them a little bit. That way they can sit right there on that frame rail that y'all see right there. And hopefully it works as planned. But... It's all right. We're getting somewhere now. Now she's a uh, she's looking ready for for a flatbed. Well, she's been ready for a flatbed. It's just we've installing on it. So let me continue doing this, and hopefully here in the next couple hours, couple minutes for y'all, that bitch will be on here. But until then, we'll see y'all guys in a little bit. As y'all can tell, it's just me at the shop today. So hey, we're getting somewhere. And we'll check back with y'all later. All right, we're back. And here's where we're at. Now we can uh, cut pieces off that we needed to cut off. So we're about to find out. She's about to go on the truck. And uh, it's a little bit harder than usual because it's just me here. So we're going to put you guys maybe right here. Let's see if this works. No? Right over here somewhere. All right, so hopefully y'all can see that. And let's get to it.
We're like, oh yeah, we're getting somewhere. Yeah. Now we just need to, gotta cut that piece off right there so we can get past that. And then that way we can kind of do this and kind of make her sit this way. But yeah, we're getting there. We are getting there. And then right here, I have to get that gas cap out of the way. That way she can sit flush. So we're gonna have to redirect that that way for now. And then that way she can come down. But yeah, that's the update. Uh, we're still here. So we're gonna keep working on this and hopefully with the magic of YouTube editing and all that, y'all guys can see once the finished product is on, once we have it all sitting down. With that, y'all be safe and we'll see y'all next time because it's gonna be a long video. So we'll keep doing this and then we'll show you all the update once we're done. Hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. If y'all didn't, give me a thumbs down. If y'all liked it, thumbs up please. And uh, y'all be safe. We'll see y'all next time and happy new years.